Stone, founder of the colony Nuestra Señora Guadalupe de Jesus Victoria, was the only Mexican impresario to found a Texas colony. But Martin did far more than that. He was one of the first cattle drivers, he owned a very large ranch, and was part of a plot to defeat Santa Ana during the Alamo battle. Martin was born in Burgos, Mexico in 1765. His family was wealthy and well-educated. <clears throat> Instead of attending school, Martin decided to become a merchant, and in 1790, he joined Feliz de Burgos, a company that helped protect his frontier from Indians. Martin gained much money from this venture and bought a large ranch with great plains and fine cattle. Martin later married Patricia de Galza and had six children. Soon after, Patricia's father died, leaving behind $10,000 for his daughter's family. <clears throat> Both in 1802 and in 1809, Martin asked the Spanish government to found a Texas colony. But both offers were sadly declined. Martin persisted and, in 1824, asked a third time. Only this offer was met with great success. Finally obtaining this goal of many years, Martin named his new Texas colony Nuestra Señora Guadalupe de Jesus Victoria, which is currently known as Victoria, Texas. It was a large colony with about 41 Mexican families. <clears throat> Several years later, in 1833, Martin died of cholera during an, ep an epidemic. Cholera is a bacteria that infects your small intestines. Although dead, Martin's works have inspired the work have inspired the industries of both cattle driving and ranching. 